Hello, my name is Anika Wayman from the U.S. Agency for International Development. We have created five video modules to help you as you prepare your peer science proposal. Module one presents an overview of the peer science program. I hope you've had a chance to watch that video. You can find this video on the peer science website. The website also lists and details previous peer science awardees. Today, I want to share with you the most important requirements so that you can consider these as you begin preparing your peer science proposal. You must be a researcher at a university, NGO, nonprofit, or research organization in order to apply to peer science. You must live and conduct research in one of the listed peer science eligible countries in order to apply. No, we encourage those who are in non-eligible countries to partner with a scientist from a peer science eligible country. Regional collaborations are encouraged. Yes, Congratulations. Let's go to the next critical questions. USCID has nearly 100 missions across the world, each with different development objectives and research interest. USAID also has our policy framework that you can find on the website to get a better understanding of USAID's overall development objectives. Peer Science also has additional opportunities for grant seekers conducting research in special interest countries and special research areas. Now let's take a look at some of the specific requirements that you must consider when developing your peer science proposal. Peer science grants range from 30,000 to 60,000 a year. More complex projects, which typically involve multiple institutions, can request up to $110,000 per year for up to three years. Your peer science research project must be a minimum of one year and a maximum of three years. And there is an extremely critical requirement, what we call the overhang rule. Your proposed peer science research project must be conducted within or overlap the time period of your U.S. partner's research project. Yes. And in the next module, my colleague Deandra Beck from NSF will demonstrate how you can find an NSF-funded partner. Thank you for spending these few moments to watch this video. I hope the information was useful and I encourage you to apply to the Peer Science Program. And don't forget you can find answers to many of your questions on the Peer Science website.